Welcome to the challenge round. Here's the breakdown. The first competitor, standing 5 feet 8 inches, weighing 237 pounds, Pavel Ablanaki. And his opponent, standing 5 feet 11 inches, weighing 240 pounds, Milo Sersev. Let us begin with the front relaxed pose. Right out of the chute, and I can tell that this is going to be an interesting battle. If you'll take note of the upper bodies here, and uh, just neglect the legs for just one second. And Pavel Havlnaki is uh, definitely scoring ahead, in my opinion. But then when you look at the legs, it's uh, boys against men. As it is in the arm department... And uh, reverse the roles here. So it's an interesting uh, battle. But uh, I think the uh, superior ab development of Milo Sersev is going to edge him out a one point victory for this one. So let's head, head into the first pose, which is the front double bicep. I'm uh, leaning towards Milo Sersev in this one. Not by a huge, huge margin, if you're uh, just looking at the upper body. Uh, Pavel is, in my opinion, a little bit harder and grainier. But then you look at uh, Milo; his skin looks paper thin here. So it's a, it's a, it's a pick 'em. But then you look at the legs, and uh, Milo's legs are very impressive in this competition here. So uh, without goes without saying, in my opinion here, I'm gonna get a uh, Milo Sersev another victory. So now let's uh, have a look at the front lat spread. And both guys look uh, pretty terrific in this pose. And I think depending on who's vote or who's uh, judging this, it could go either way. But in my opinion, I think Milo Sersev has it in the bag. His uh, overwhelming conditioning scores, scores him a victory, in my opinion, for sure. I believe this is a little earlier on in his career, so his legs aren't quite as massive. But, uh, that's three victories in a row for Milo, so, uh, not, lo not looking very good for Pavel. But let's have a look at the side chest pose. And it looks like Pavel's gonna get a, his first victory in the, here in the side chest. His uh, massive chest, just massive, thick chest here, is enough, in my opinion, to score a victory over the uh, superior conditioning, I will admit here. Of Milo Sersev. I don't think Pavel is going to be able to touch Milo in the conditioning department, but I think the massive arms and shoulders and chest here is just enough to edge it a victory. So uh, it's a first for Pavel. Now we'll get these guys to turn around and snap a rear lat spread. I am going to edge out a slight victory here for Pavel Habanaki. But uh, it's close. It's close. If you look at the lag department, there's no doubt that uh, Milo Sersev is scoring a victory in that department. But I look at the traps, and Milo really has no trap development to speak of. And even, even in the glute department here, Milo really has a narrow little tiny ham hock. But um, having said that, I'm going to edge out a victory for Pavel. And uh, let's get these guys to stay turned around and snap a rear double bicep pose. Looks like a dominant victory here for Pavel. Milo Sersev is uh, really having a difficult time to executing the rear double bicep pose correctly. I believe this is a little later on in his career. So you'll notice his arms look um, rather swollen. Perhaps some sort of uh, sight enhancement oil. But anyway, that's not what this video is about. Um, Pavel, without a doubt, has superior back development. And once again, that little tiny set of ham hocks that uh, Milo Sersev is sporting is doing him no favors in this rear double bicep. 
But having said that, uh, Pavel pulls himself out of the fire and uh, makes us a uh, battle. So let's get these guys to turn back around and uh, hit a most muscular pose. And it looks like Pavel has uh, more than uh, pulled himself out of the fire. He's really taken the lead in this competition. This most muscular is a very impressive one, to say the very least. The ripped and grainy look of his chest here. You can uh, really tell that Milo, now he uh, definitely, in my opinion, has some sort of sight enhancement oil in those arms. But anyway, um, Pavel is definitely winning this crab most muscular. But let's be fair and have these guys hit another variation of the most muscular pose. This one's a little bit harder to judge. I believe uh, both guys have a case for victory here in the upper body, that is. So when I look down at the lags, it's uh, it's night-night. It's all she wrote. Milo Sersev is uh, taking this one home. I will say, uh, Pavel's arms here is... Particularly the biceps are more than enough to match up to Milo. But as I said through this whole competition, the ab development of Milo is uh, scoring ahead. So that, coupled with the lag department, is enough to score him a victory in the second most muscular. So, um, I believe it's, uh, it's all tied up now. So let's have these gentlemen uh, hit a side tricep pose, for, uh, and this one will decide the victory. I guess both guys are going to make it easy on me on this one. Not a very aesthetically pleasing pose for uh, Pavel. And just an outstanding one for Milo Sersev. So, as I tally up the points here, it's uh, plain to see that your winner of this challenge round is Milo Sersev. <laughs> Milo Sersev will now wait the challenge of another challenge round winner to do battle in the gladiator round.